Tom, it's been a fast-moving first day. What's your assessment of it? Yeah, I think, you know, obviously it's been a pretty full-on full on day. You know, a fair few runs scored and a fair few wickets taken as well. So I think um, I think they'd probably be happy in the position they're at come the end of the day. I think, you know, uh, Middleton played really nicely, you know, soaked up pressure and then applied pressure nicely to our bowlers. And I don't think... We probably bowled at our, our very best, although I think we still bowled pretty well and, and didn't get the rewards for it. So, um, yeah, it was, it's been a pretty good day. It was, you know, the way we went out there and batted to look to apply pressure, I thought they bowled outstandingly well. I think, you know, obviously Abbas showed his quality uh, once again in the way he bowled. Um, but I think, you know, that's the way I think we thought the pitch would play. You know, it's, it's, uh, it's a pitch that's got a bit in it for both, it's got stuff in it for the batsmen but it's also plenty there for the bowlers and there's there's plenty of good balls flying around which we saw today so yeah I think you know fairly evenly poised day but maybe just maybe there towards the end. You top scored for knots with uh, with an unbeaten 49, what did that innings demand of you today? Yeah I think just looking to be positive really like I said you know the wicket you felt at any stage that you could have a you know one with your name on it you never quite felt in uh, we know that with here you know, there's always the ball does do do a fair bit, and with the with the quality of their bowlers, um, you know they they put that under pressure. So I think, you know, Joey played out you know outstandingly well, and, and again was was unfortunate to get a nice ball there towards the back end. Um, but you know, batting with him and then trying to build partnerships down the order was just my goal really. And and um, yeah, nice start today would have been nice to kick on a few you know to get a few more, and unfortunately ran out of partners, but. Um, yeah, felt felt nice and nice to start the season in that way. Yeah, how important was it for you to, to marshal those last few wickets effectively in, in what is proven to be quite a low scoring game so far? Yeah, it's always, you know, it's pretty tricky um, because you've got different, you know, down the order, different skill sets and, and, you know, different sort of personnel and people who want to go about it a bit, a bit differently. So, um, yeah, just trying to talk to them, communicate, uh, you know, Estonia and I put a nice little partnership on there and and sort of tried to just extend that as much as we could and same with Fletch and then all the way down to to Dane at the end um, it's always entertaining batting with him you never know what you're gonna you're gonna quite get um, but ultimately you know he wants to play a, a you know a game that's on the front foot and, and take it to the bowlers and we see with his bowling as well he, that's how he wants to do so yeah it's all you know it's exciting and, and I think having the relationship I've got I know them all real well now so we can have discussions out in the middle and try and be uh, you know it's always a game of cat and mouse when it gets to that that back end and the you know a batter in and batting with the tail we you know we've seen no one I don't think anyone's quite nailed it down yet <coughs> so yeah it was uh, unfortunately today we couldn't extend it and, and make it a dangerous partnership but if we keep going in the future hopefully we can and three Hampshire wickets to fall in the evening session you had a great view of Lyndon's wicket for one yeah I think that was ball of the day I think um, you know, we've seen with Lyndon, you know, time and time again, him at his best is can get anyone out. And we we only have to look at the the wickets he's got in the first class game. Um, you know, he's got some some big names under his belt. So, uh, yeah, we, there's, there's a reason we call him Golden Arm because I think he's he's got the he's got the ball of the century in him. So I think when we saw that today and getting someone like James out, who's a high class player, was was very valuable for us. Yeah, and, and for the overall balance of the side, how important has it been to see him back bowling today? Yeah, definitely, you know, to have, you know, both assets of his game available um, and to have him, you know, doing doing what he does like that is is so valuable for us as a team because he, like I said, he has a he has a knack of getting big players out and he has, a, you know, just breaking partnerships. He, he's got that ball in him. So, um, you know, and we saw that again today, which is great. Cheers, Tom. Cheers. Thank you.